All right, Tim, thank you. No surprise here. The roadways have been a mess, leaving cars stranded on the sides of road and even some spinning out of control. And those big tractor trailers seem to be out in full force today on Interstate 40. But as WREG's Michael Quander explains, the drives in Arkansas have been far from smooth sailing. They're usually the big dogs on the road, but today ice took over. It's almost impossible to drive. Tom Wells is hauling his load from Texas to Chicago, but today he's stuck on I-40 right here in Arkansas. Well, it's, it's, it's going to cancel our load, obviously. It's, there's no way we'll get there on time. We'll be there tomorrow morning. And he's not alone. Dozens of trucks were backed up for miles on this ice-covered interstate. Ice, some drivers say, should have been dealt with. Arkansas just needs to learn how to take care of their roads a little bit better. I must have seen about 20 cars in the ditch, uh, semis jackknifing as they're going down the road. I was slipping and sliding about four different times. And Wells says that's four times too many for an Arctic blast known about for days. I can't believe the state doesn't do something about it. Uh, no salt trucks or nothing out here. I haven't, I haven't seen one all day. That's just un unbelievable that they don't do something to a major highway like this to prepare the roads. It's, it's just unreal. In Arkansas, along Interstate 40, Michael Quander, WREG, News Channel 3. And by the way, we reached out to the Arkansas State Highway and Transportation Department for comment, but they have yet to return our calls. And some truckers had problems on Interstate 40 in North Little Rock today. Take a look at this. This truck jackknifed during its drive this morning. Arkansas Highway officials have reported road problems all over the state with several icy patches.